Hey guys, we just finished up a week-long event that saw huge player groups fighting each other on the Draconis Expanse server. For those of you who haven't watched my other videos, we have divided the player population into three huge groups called nations, modeled after the Expanse universe, the United Nations, the Martian Congressional Republic, and the Outer Planets Alliance. The admin team has decided to spawn in a protogen station and the nations are fighting over the data that is being extracted from the data core in the center of the station. To control the station, you have to deploy infantry and marines and take the station's central control room using foot and infantry tactics. But to get the data out, you need to use your fleet and control the airspace around the station. This provides a really cool mechanic where you have huge fleet fights happening outside of the station. Meanwhile, infantry combat is happening inside the station. We saw a really cool narrative where the UN controlled the station for the first few days. Meanwhile, the MCR and the OPA were prepping for huge pushes that would eventually lead them both to overtake the UN, with the UN making a last minute comeback to get second, with the MCR in first and the OPA in third. Throughout this event, I think we saw the most combat we've ever seen on server with some incredible fleet fights and small skirmishes like 1v1s and 2v2s that really just showed off individual pilot skills and really reinforced the idea that pilot skill is incredibly important on this server. With that said, here's the rest of the footage. I hope you enjoy watching these three huge player groups go at it for a week straight. There's more footage than I could even put in this video, and there's definitely more footage than I can talk over. Enjoy.
what you just witnessed was a unaffiliated ship that decided to sacrifice themselves against the whole Martian fleet. Um, at the end of the event, the Martians decided to make a statement and take back the station. Uh, and after the event was over, the station became uninvincible and they were allowed to destroy it after the data was all extracted. I think even though the Martians started off the event a little slowly, they were able to rally their members and really make a huge comeback and just really display their prowess and their fleet strength as they dominated the rest of the event after the beginning. I hope you all enjoyed this video and make sure to like and subscribe.